I want to take just a moment and tell you about the beginning of this story that unfolds here today. Jacob wanted to go out with Cassie. He really wanted to make a real impression upon her, so he planned a very romantic trip. He took her fishing. He smiled real big and told me that on that trip he caught a real keeper. I asked him, was it a crappie or was it a bass? He said, oh, Papa, it was Cassie. Me and Jake, uh, we grew up together. We were always really close, had each other's backs. So Mom always said we were inseparable, and we went everywhere together. So uh, I'm just happy that he found someone that loves him and will treat him right, and that he can spend the rest of his life with. And I want to welcome Cassie to the family and her family to our family, and I'm uh, happy to call you my uh, sister. And to Jacob, I just couldn't have picked a better man to walk through my little baby sister's life with her. We are just excited to really officially welcome you in. He is just the little brother that we never had and we couldn't ask for a better guy in her life. Cassie and Jacob, you have come here today to join your hands and your hearts. Marriage is honorable. It is the cornerstone and the foundation of the human race and the human family. Without it, society will lose its God-given meaning and purpose. Jacob, do you take Cassie to be your wife? Cassie, do you take Jacob to be your husband? Serve her in sickness and in health, in adversity and prosperity, and to be true and loyal to him so long as you both shall live. Amen. By the authority of God and the laws of this state, I declare that Cassie and Jacob are husband and wife. You may kiss your wife. Family and friends, it is my pleasure and my joy to introduce to you Mr. and Mrs. Jacob Rogers.